fleeing the Avengers, Submariner searches the ocean for his lost people until he encounters Eskimos worshipping a man frozen in ice. Taking out his anger on them, Namor throws the ice block into the North Sea and scares off the Eskimos. Seeking Namor in a submarine, the Avengers find and rescue the Thawing Man, discovering to their shock that he is Captain America, missing since World War II. Cap wakes screaming for his partner Bucky, but swiftly regains his composure, proving his identity via some friendly sparring with the Avengers and explaining how he was frozen. April 18, 1945. Captain America and Bucky try to stop Baron Zemo from launching an experimental drone plane loaded with explosives, boarding it as it takes off. It explodes when Bucky tries to defuse it. Bucky is caught in the explosion while Cap falls into the water. While Cap sleeps inside the sub, the Avengers are greeted by reporters upon their return to New York, only to suddenly be turned to stone. Emerging later, Cap thinks they're statues and wanders New York until Rick Jones asks him to help him find the missing Avengers. They determine a photographer is responsible and Cap finds him with the Teen Brigade's help. Quickly defeating the photographer's men, Cap discovers the photographer is a stranded alien working for Namor in return for having his ship recovered from the seabed. Centuries ago, Vuk crashes to Earth and his ship is embedded at the bottom of the sea. He wanders the Earth and uses his ray gun to turn people into stone for defense. Cap convinces him to restore the Avengers, unaware Namor is monitoring events remotely. The Submariner chances to encounter some of his elite guard, and while the Avengers are raising the aliens' crashed spacecraft, Namor and his Atlanteans attack them. Their battle ends when Namor mistakes the spaceship launching for an earthquake and flees. While Cap joins the Avengers, Rick worries that the Hulk will be angry when he learns he has been replaced.